Hello and welcome back to another Space Engineers episode where I just remembered I was doing light roleplay and doing star days. I haven't done that for a while, mainly because I took a big chunk of time off in between episodes and forgot about it. Anyway, that's not important. So the last episode <laughs> we found some required resources to build our shield. It's up there, it's running, it's great, it's awesome. <clears throat> it's powered down at the moment so I don't have to run out of power. Um, what I think we need to do today is probably, it'd be a good idea, to get some sort of welding ship up and running because there's lots of damage in, on the outside of this ship, um, as you may have noticed with all of the glowing fire and projector things appearing. And what I'm thinking is, what we're going to have to do is, I think we're going to have to grind down this refinery. <coughs> I'm dying again. Every time I start talking, my throat's like, no, I don't want to do it. Yeah, I think we're going to have to get rid of this refinery. Um, it's served its purpose. We don't really need it anymore, at least not right now. In the future, we will have um, a base. So, yeah. So, thank you for your service, refinery. You did well. But it is now time for you to be removed because I need to use this hangar for hangar bay reasons, not refining reasons. So I'm just going to quickly get rid of this and then we're going to build ourselves a welding ship. Did I mention that? I don't know. <coughs> yeah, my brain's a bit weird. Also, I haven't been depressurizing the bays when I leave. That's been... Oh. That was on purpose. Um, yeah, it, it was taking too long. I need to put more vents in here but now the problem is I think the containers are full so uh, I don't know I'm having issues well, it's, it's fine it's, we're gonna ignore that all right also this is this is bugging me um, so you guys gotta go back to the way you were I just I, I can't handle the, the there we go thanks much better okay so what I want to do is I want to build um, a, a welding ship it's just gonna be a little basic welding ship I'm thinking something like um, of a, uh, I don't know what I'm thinking. Uh, hmm. I might have like just one, should we go one or two welders and two cargo containers? I might go two medium cargo containers or two welders. Um, yeah, I don't know. Let's have a look. Let's just put that down here. Okay, so. Just go here, like that. Don't like you, Ben. Nope, oh, okay, okay. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. It's fine. <laughs> Gotta be careful. Gotta be careful when doing things. Alright. <clears throat> so I'm thinking. Alright, we're gonna need a cockpit. We always need a cockpit. Um, so you got that there. Alright, we got that there. Up the top. Should we have a little H2 generator on this thing? I really wish that these um, connector ports were down one, because then this could go and sit flush. Because at the moment, uh, it doesn't. It, uh, it, it'll be up high, which I don't like. Alright, let's just go here. Let's put the welder. I'm thinking... Uh, should I have it forward? Like that much, and then I guess we'll have it that much. So we'll have the waters like that. Then we'll have medium cargo containers attached to the rear here, like so. Two medium cargo containers that should do that. Then what we're going to need is um. I need some power, so we'll go with a battery, because you know me, I love my battery powered ships. Alright, let's go battery, let's go with a warfare battery there. Maybe what I can do is I can sneak another warfare battery underneath here. Alright, like that. Uh, seven battery, like so. There we go, we got that. And then what we're going to need is probably a connector. Um, 
Do these medium cargo containers are double sided, aren't they? Yeah, they are. So, I am going to do something. I don't know. This is going to probably look really weird. And I'm kind of digging that theory. So, if we put that like that. Alright, have that there. Okay. Uh, let's just reconnect this here so I can get rid of these ones. Like so. Let's have that there. Alrighty. So, do that, we'll do that. And then we got to connect this cargo container to this cargo container. I think the way we might do that is... Yeah, okay, so I think the way we might do that is we might run a conveyor belt from here around the back of this onto the top of this one as well. I don't know why I want to do that way. I think it might look alright. And then I've got to slap a gyro and a couple thrusters on this thing. So I'm going to weld this up and then we'll be right back and see what we can do about getting this ship sort of repaired and functioning not near death again. I'm just casually minding my own business when I noticed this guy is coming in and I gotta quickly run to the bridge because I'm pretty sure the shields are down and I don't want to get shot and lose all my crap. Oop, that's uh, yep, okay, five. Five, shields up. Something blew up down there, that's fine, I don't care about that. Okay, where are you? Alright. It's over there. I don't want to be shot at. I don't. I don't like being shot at. Where are you going? Are you, are you flying away? This is very scary. Well, either way, I'm gonna leave that up for now. I'm gonna show you my progress. Might as well. Uh, we're making a bit of progress on the welding ship to repair the ship that's sort of under attack right now, but not. I don't know what they're doing. The AI is being AI. -y. But here is what we've got going on now. There's lots of booms. <laughs> we just got to ignore it. So yeah, this is what we got going on now. Um, the ship had to be made a bit longer than I originally anticipated because it turns out when you're not when you don't have a suit, you uh, need oxygen <laughs> attached to the ship. Who would have thought? Um, though I did connect it up and it gave put oxygen in the car in the in this thing. So maybe I don't need the O2 generator. I don't know. I have it. It's there. But I'm just kind of toying around with the idea of making it probably this big it's bigger than I wanted originally I had these a uh, set back um, I only had to two cargo medium cargo containers one there and one there I did I'm toying with the idea of putting another two here but to be honest I'm not really liking it um, yeah I don't know let me go you got let me know what you think in the comment if I should make it bigger if I should just keep it to like it was like this I believe before yeah I kinda like it like that I kinda like the little short stubby version so I'm thinking that's what I'm gonna stick to for now just a nice little stubby version yeah. um, I'm gonna put that there and I need another frame in there Yeah, I think that is what I'm going to stick with. This is just so everything didn't fall apart. Yeah, that, that, that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking that's going to be a little ship. It's got thrust in every direction. I've still got to set up all the controls and stuff for it. But what I quickly want to do is your your magnet. That is like the weakest way to be magneted. Magnetized? Magnetized? Magnetized to the ground. I just want to have a quick look on the outside here make sure everything is okay all right where is the bad guys all gone I think the bad guys are all gone just a quick fly out it's pitch black I can't see anything that's probably good um can't see any fire I don't know I think I'm gonna leave the shields up just for a little bit I don't want to leave them up too long because they are draining my power. Like I got 10, 13 hours, 11 hours, 7 hours of power. Whereas when I had them down it was like a lot more. Let's have a look. Let's just, this is probably dangerous. Turn them down. Yeah, like we got to like 18 to a day's worth of power. So, 
Yeah, we're just gonna we're gonna leave them on for now. All right, I'm gonna quickly. Actually, do I have anything to finish? Uh, I don't think I really have anything left to finish on that ship. I think she may be done. She may be. It may be time for us to get some welding done on the ship and get some repairs going. I think that's 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 gonna be my next our next move. Well, I was just here minding my own business, welding up the ship, and that ship just, we just got attacked. <laughs> lots and lots of bullets came flying at us. Uh, that's okay, the, uh, the ship took care of it, the shields held firm, they protected both the main ship and me. Um, so yeah, that was, that was an exciting moment. But yeah, this, this little welding ship, it's doing its job quite well. It's getting everything all welded up pretty nice and neatly, as I as it appears. The thruster engines are becoming back online. Um, yeah, I can't really complain. I don't... Oh, how far do I have to stick in, like, get right in there to repair you? Apparently. I don't know why you're not working. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'll figure that out. But yeah, everything's coming up pretty good. Um, the, the ship is a pretty good success. I'm happy with how it's working. I apparently didn't load up everything I need. I'm still thinking that, oh, maybe, oh, I doubt it. I don't think that's going to happen. That, that that couldn't work, would it? I was thinking maybe I could connect this ship up. Wait, why did you weld that one up? But then you wouldn't weld the other one up. Uh, maybe if I go in first person, I can get close enough to the thing and weld you up there we go much better much much better but yeah I'm liking how this is going everything is getting welded up now I think the next part of today's episode is I'm going to want to put the outline hmm, I don't know I was thinking should I put the outline of the base that I want to do up or should I hmm, Maybe, can I repair whatever it is that's on fire and then it's like making smoke in my room? That'd be great. So I was thinking, should I have the, should we do the outline of the base? Or should I just build a small section? So the outline of the base, um, I'm thinking what I want. I don't know if I've actually mentioned this yet. I want to have okay so we've got like this crater this crater here right so what I'm thinking is we'd have an underground hangar and then maybe a base that's kind of built into these little mountains maybe I think I think that might be the I think that's kind of what I've got in my mind um, at the moment, I'm not too sure. I'm gonna have to give it a little bit more thought on exactly how I want. But I do know for sure I want a underground hangar for the ship because there's a certain angle that you come at from this base. Let's go this camera mode. Can I find the angle that I'm talking about? Like there was an angle that you come at this hangar. Something exploded. Oh, there's that ship that attacked us. Gotta be careful not to go too high. Am I in the right hole? <laughs> there was like a little pathway that you could fly, and it was like a, it was like perfect for a um, like hangar entrance type thing. Mm, no, that's not it. I might not even be in the right hole. <laughs> There's so many holes on this asteroid that I don't know. Uh, yes, this this is the right hole, isn't it? Am I just at a bad angle? Or maybe it was over this way. I think it was over this way. It was over this way. Yep, that, that's why I'm getting all confused. So I, I was thinking like you could kind of fly down here, right? This would be like a pathway in. 
and then there'd be like a big hanger door here there'd be a floor up here a big giant hangar entrance here and you can just fly ships into here and then land them down here sort of that that was my kind that that's kind of my thinking for it um we'll have to i'm gonna have to do a bit of work also i noticed earlier is it still here there was like a weird tunnel that came into the side of the mountain it was odd i noticed it in 3d camera mode I can't seem to find it right now. Maybe it was just a glitch in the matrix. Maybe it was a glitch in the matrix? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. There was like a little tunnel that went from one side of the asteroid and came out the other end and it was like this weird like perfectly cylindrical tunnel like someone had dug it but it had like a it was a, a glitchy entrance? I don't know. It was weird. It's not there. I can't find it now. It must be just my imagination. But yeah, I'm going to quickly finish welding this up and then, uh, yeah, i got to figure out what the base is going to be, how, what, what part of the base we're going to work on first. Okay, well there was, there it is, there's another enemy lurking over the things. Well, i got bad news for you, enemy person. I have repaired all the turrets on my ship and they are now ready to destroy you with ever never ending or always ending I don't know they're gonna destroy you they're gonna shoot you they're gonna make you go boom um, I also realize I'm probably gonna be running low on, low on um, uh, ammo uh, mag because I haven't mined any magnesium also another benefit another bonus for today is I discovered I can connect the ship up <laughs> to this connector it's pretty cool wait for it wait for it so I'm going to do it. There we go. I can connect the ship up. <laughs> so that's pretty cool. I like that. Um, that's actually extremely useful. And now, now I don't have to find somewhere to sneak on a um, little uh, a little connector on the outside. All right. So first off, I need to destroy that cursor. Can you, can you make your way over here, buddy? Or am I going to have to... I think I'm going to have to um, dock the ship and go over there and shoot you myself. Because I don't like having things near my base. I also want to t turn these shields off so I stop wasting power. So let's go dock this ship and then we'll go shoot that guy in the face. Alright, let's go shoot this guy. Thinks he can invade our territory. Well, yeah, I got news for you, buddy. You can't. Uh, he mustn't have any turret weapons left. Does he not have any weapons left? Okay, well he's not shooting at us. Alright, okay, so he's not shooting at us. We're just going to park the ship here. And what we're going to do is we're going to jump in our new ship. And I'm going to do some dangerous space piloting. Alright, so what I'm basically going to do is I'm going to have to fly up to the thing, jump out of my suit, grind down all these control things, jump back in the ship. All the while, hoping I don't float away. Um... Yeah, this is uh, definitely not something I would recommend people do, but it is something I'm going to do for fun, because why the hell not? Alright, so let's just go through here, go through here, we click on here, we quickly suck all the oxygen out of this room, because it actually works on this one. Alright, then we pick that up. I probably should have actually changed these over to grinders. Hmm. Yeah, that probably would have been a smart idea. But it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Let's get, let's get this, uh, not that one. Where's the cursor? It's on the other side of the ship. All right. This is not a very maneuverable ve vehicle. Um, which is fine. It's an industrial vehicle. But i got to keep that in mind while going over here. Also, I don't want to accidentally walk up his weapons or something like that. That could be bad. All right. So what we need to do is we need to get close enough to this bad boy. Um, mm, no, 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 it's okay. It's okay. I'm here to help. We're friends. Alright? It's okay. We're, we're friends. It's fine. It's fine. This this is going to end terribly. Okay, so he still has some power. Alright, I was hoping the battery grinding down will get him. Alright, let's have a look. 
All right, where is where is the good stuff? Okay, so we got this control panel up there. All right, can we? Can I jump out and grind that down quickly without it, the game? Nope. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Ha 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 ha! I think it is sort of captured. Okay, yeah, it's definitely it's free. Um. For me to claim. Alright, so how are we gonna claim this? That's uh how much health have I got? 70 health. This is like the sketchiest way to do things. There's way more batteries on this than that just that one. Okay. Now let's just go here. Go here, go here, go control panel, go here, go control there, go transfer owner to me. Bam, no, yes, to me, yes, okay, quick, quick, quick. No, I'm pushing all the low. <laughs> Okay, we have successfully captured this thing. Also, I need to turn your damn beacon off. Um, get yeah, quickly, quickly, your control panel, uh, cursor, uh, off, uh, get in there, okay. Your health is critical. <sighs> That's okay. Okay, now what I think we're going to do is we're going to go inside this guy. And by inside this guy, I'm going to go back into our ship here, where it's nice and safe. And I'm going to heal up, and I'm going to change out these welders for grinders. Because we need to grind that boy, get that boy down, and hopefully get some ammo, and some other goodies off him. I'm hoping he has uranium, to be honest with you, because, you know... Yeah, I like uranium. <laughs> it provides lots of power. Alright, I wanted to try something probably stupid. <laughs> and I want to see if I can scoop this ship up <laughs> in my hangar bay here because I feel like that would be easier than converting the um, welding ship into a grinding ship for the simple fact that um, small grid ships when you grind them will bounce around everywhere and we're in space so that means that there's going to be a lot a lot of floating away happening so I'm just trying to Nope, just, just, I'm just trying to try to scoop this thing up. Just a little, it's fine, it's okay, we're good. I just want to scoop... <laughs> this is potentially the stupidest thing I've ever done, and yet, yeah, same. Is that a floating missile up there? I'm gonna need to remember that there's a floating missile up there, because that will come in handy. Um, because I don't have the things to make more floating missiles, but I'm pretty sure I'm out of missiles. Are you in? Like, in, in? Because I know you're a bit bigger than the... I think you're bigger than the bay itself. That's fine, that's fine. I can't... I, ooh. 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 I think I may have got it in there. Oh. Oh. I think that worked brilliantly. <laughs> Did that really just work? That, that's, um... That's, um... Okay, uh, if everything doesn't flip out. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, oh, you hit the back a little bit, but that's okay, you didn't. Oh my god, I think we've done it. I think we've... Oh, you now belong... Oh. Oh, this is a problem. <laughs> um, this is a big problem. I'm... Uh, oh, no. <laughs> no, this is a problem. This is... <laughs> Help! <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, I don't think I can fix this. Um... Yeah, um... Bugger! <laughs> I have no jetpack. I, I can't... I, I can't move. Um... Yes, random bird. Uh, nope, that didn't do what I needed to do. I was hoping that would kind of push me. Um. Oh no! What have I done? <laughs> so why doesn't the gravity go out this far? Oh god! It's actually. Oh man! There's only one way. To, there's only one thing for it. <laughs> I don't want to do it. Uh, don't. Um. Can I maybe build a ladder? 
I don't have anything in my inventory, that's the problem. Uh, maybe? Oh, can I? Do I have enough for a ladder? I need interior plates. No! Oh, man. Everyone look away. Alright, just just look away. Yep, yeah, it's fine. This is stupid. That was stupid. Nothing happened. You saw nothing. I didn't have to commit uh, self-sleep because I walked into a no-gravity area. Nothing at all. Totally not the thing that occurred. Alright, I don't, I don't need these false accusations against me. And that's not what I wanted. I just wanted a normal landing gear. Alright, so I just need to landing gear this down to the ship. Um, go like there. Okay, and can I... Okay, maybe there's like a control panel somewhere where I can just turn all of this off so I can push it down. Um, Control panel, control A, uh, control panel, control A. Really, I can't just oh, off. Yeah, batteries off. All of you off. All of you off. All of you off. All of you. Okay, well, all two of you off. All of you off. Eh! Go down. I didn't think that would work. <laughs> but yeah, I'm generally surprised uh, we, we managed to actually get this. Does it have any goods left? That's it. It has a little bit of goods. It's fine. I'm going to have to grind all of you down. Um, then I think we can actually get to work on building the base. I still haven't decided how we're going to start the base. I don't know. I'm thinking well, we're going to need... I'm thinking the pressure is just just a room with a couple of refineries in it. I'm gonna need one of the Zardos connectors to connect the ship to and for me to move in and out of it nice and effectively. Yeah. Yep. I'm thinking that's the thing. That's the thing. I just gotta decide where we wanna put it. Hmm. Brain power. I don't have much of it. I'm gonna have to make an apology to you guys because I told you we were gonna start on the base today. But I've run out of time and now we're not. <laughs> it's alright, this is going to be a decently long, decent length episode anyway. I'm trying to keep them shorter these days. Um, next episode I do have an idea of how I want to build the thing. Um, basically, I want to build... Uh, let's go FA camera. Yep, okay, FA camera. I kind of... So this is going to be the entrance way here. Um, coming through here there's gonna be like an underground hangar like I said and then up on this wall back here I want to have the first part of the base which was what we're gonna to build tomorrow uh, well next episode rather not tomorrow in the next episode we're gonna build that around here I want there to be like a viewing platform looking down here into the hangar eventually but um, for now we're just gonna to have to build like just just a basic survival box we're gonna, like come in here we'll have a bunch of refineries and um, oxygen and power production because <coughs> as it stands um, having the ship is great but I, I need more room I need to be able to put down like better power generation I want to use renewable stuff like solar power and as well which I want to eventually dot all around the asteroid um, and things like that especially when we get a shield generator I don't want to be reliant upon uranium you burn through uranium pretty quick but the problem with solar power is you need a crap ton of solar panels for it to do it. But luckily we're in space, so, you know, there's plenty of space to build solar panels. I don't know. But that's going to be it for this episode, guys. It was pretty productive anyway. We built ourselves a new welding ship, which is just crammed in here with a mining ship. There he is. Nice, beautiful little mini weldy is what I called it. The mini weldy. Don't, I don't know. Don't ask me questions. <laughs> and uh, look at that little mining ship in there too at the moment. Uh, we managed to repair the ship, so we've got a mini weldy, we repaired the ship, and we ground down a, a bomber, uh, a, an enemy fighter that we scooped up. I also completely and utterly forgot about the rockets that were floating in space, and I have no idea where the ship was, so RIP, dum dum me. 
Anyway, that's going to be it for now, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that other fun stuff. And as always, have a good one, and we'll see you all next time. Bye! I swear there was a tunnel that went from like one side to the other. It must have been a glitch in the production of the of the terrain matrix. But now it makes me look like a fool. But you do that yourself anyway. I know, stop talking to yourself, Smokey, and go do real life stuff. You're not my real mum, you can't tell me what to do.